So this, this batch is a lot smaller than what I normally do, um, but this is what I took from that dry creek bed, stream bed. And I'll be adding this to, to what I already have in storage from, from before. And this is going to be a little wetter than what I normally take it out at. But again, I'll be adding it in. It's still pretty muddy. But it'll work. Alright, store this up. So clay by itself goes through a lot of processes as it dries and then as I fire it, it'll actually shrink up and it can be prone to cracks and things like that unless you add in some kind of temper, um, which is usually like a sand or, or even shells. So in part two of this little primitive clay series, I will be collecting that and adding that in.